So today I'm going to show you how to make scanning faster and easier uh, by using an artifact, a targeted artifact, and adding clipping planes to it. So I use this um, footplate from TechMed 3D, and I'm going to end up with clipping planes on it, as in this diagram. Here is the method to actually do that. I'm going to speed it up, but basically you select lines that create clipping planes around your footplate in this case and you add uh, four walls a ceiling and a floor and nothing gets scanned outside of that um, that area that you define so you don't have any trimming to do afterwards and also it can still use the targets on the surrounding footplate even though it's not scanning them this setup is saved as a scan template and when loaded you can start scanning and it will simply scan only the object inside the box and not anything outside. So when I stop scanning, I just put my hand on this plate for the, the test. When I stop scanning, um, there will only be the hand in the middle of the plate. None of the surrounding um, frame will have been scanned. So here's the setup for the footplate. Uh, put the foot on at the last moment to avoid misting the glass. Um, I'm calling in my template, my scan template with its clipping planes. And I start by scanning the, the underside of the foot. And you notice that while it's retaining the foot, it's not retaining the frame of the artifact. And then you just, um, when you scan the foot to your satisfaction, the bottom, you go over to the other side and it immediately recognizes its target set on the top of the target, on the top of the artifact. And then you just scan around and try and acquire as much as you can with your scanner. You notice that when that bar goes red, it's because I'm too close and when it goes blue it because I'm getting a bit too far from the object. So there's the scan with nothing else apart from the foot. There's a little bit of cleanup to do, um, hole filling on the bits that I missed. I wasn't very careful about my scan. So uh, we have automatic hole fill functions that work very very well in um, our software that's included with the scanner. So I just fill in the holes and I'm going to clip off the top of the foot because I didn't in fact go all the way to the ceiling clipping plane. So I'm going to do another clip on the top of the foot. Just draw a line across the top and cut to plane. I chose to keep both parts, so I'm going to turn off the part I clipped off and check the properties of the foot with the check properties um, option. And you can have the surface area, the enclosed volume, etc, uh, etc. Et and you can even watertight that if you want to do, do so. So that's it.